How about you YouTube? Back with the service tech again. Alright guys, so today I am doing a new entry for my channel and it is going to be movie reviews with the tech. Um, yeah, I think that's what we'll call them. So mo movie reviews with the tech. And this is pretty much the rundown how I'm going to do it. For the first 10 or 15 seconds, I'm going to tell you what I thought about the movie. Then there's going to be a long pause, and then I'm actually going to talk about the movie. But when I talk, I ramble, and I don't really pay attention to what I say. So there will more than likely be spoilers. So for anybody that doesn't want spoilers, you have the first 10 or 15 seconds, whatever, to figure out, hey, this movie's good, this movie's bad, he likes it, he doesn't like it, well, you know, whatever. And then for the people that want to know what I actually think about the movie in detail, you guys can stick around. So, um, I think that's probably the fairest way to do it. That way everybody has a chance to actually find out what I like about the movie, or find out what I thought about the movie, and then from there, kind of decide whether or not they want to listen to more, or, you know, if the movie's good, they're cool with it. If the movie sucks, they're cool with it. You know, and that's all they want to know. So, alright. So we're going to start this off. And the very first movie review I'm going to do is going to be for The Witch. I know this movie has been out for a while now. Um, I actually just got a chance to watch it several days ago. Uh, it's the first time I've ever seen it. So I want to go ahead and throw it out there. Um, I do like horror movies, so um, my movies will probably reach a gambit of stuff. So what did I think about the movie? I thought it was worth watching. Um, it, it was not bad. Um, yeah, yeah. So, I mean, honestly... Um, my opinion of it is it's worth at least one watch. Um, so that's it. That's what I thought about it. Anybody that doesn't want to hear spoilers or any extra details about it, it's been uh, been great chatting with you. And see y'all next time. Y'all stay geeky. For everybody that's still tuning in, now I'm going to break down what I actually thought about the movie. Um, and again, I I thought it was good. Um. The cinematography in the movie was really great. I love the way it was shot. I love, love the dialogue throughout the entire movie. The dialogue is amazing. Um, it, it really does. It draws you into that time. Um, the references they make um, about, you know, not being in England anymore and being in the U.S. And, you know, it's the, the, the territories and, you know, just everything that they talk about it, it actually makes you feel like you're in that time period which is spot on for me the movie nails it all the way through except for the last four minutes um, I hated the ending of this movie guys I really did um, I thought it was building up throughout the entire movie and the last four or five minutes of it just fell flat. I feel like it was somebody that ran you know 10 miles and then the last 500 feet they got in the car and finished the race. Um, it just it, it fell flat for me. Um, I thought everything was really good with it. I thought it had just enough backstory to fill in any gaps and led you to believe that one, either everybody was possessed, or two, nobody was possessed. Um, I mean, the whole the whole movie was mind mind fuck after mind fuck. Um, but literally, the last four minutes of the movie just fell flat for me. Um, I was expecting so much more, and especially after a lot of the stuff that happens in this movie. Um, again, my. I wouldn't say my favorite scene, but the most fucked up scene is towards the very beginning of the movie, and the witch disembowels a baby and then grinds him up in a thing and then puts it all over her, and you know it's like, Arr! you know, it's like holy crap. But I mean, yes, the movie was cool. The movie was worth a watch, but be prepared to be disappointed. If you're anything like me and you expect like a horror movie to have a great last 10 15 minutes leaving you saying what the hell was that that was awesome no I was left going what the fuck 
just happened because I have no idea. Um, and then seriously, that's exactly what happened. As soon as the credits started rolling, I was like, "What?" I, I looked at my girlfriend. I was completely lost. I was like, "What did we just watch? What just happened?" I, I don't get it. Seriously, it just stops. It just ends. You know, I'm like, "Oh, all the crap that happened." What? Sorry, uh, pop-up window just popped up on my computer. That was weird. Uh, anyways, so yeah, I was left dumbfounded with this movie. Um, again, great movie for most of it. Um, I, I really just hated the way it ended. And I know there are going to be people that's going to bash on me and all this other stuff. The best part about this is this is my opinion. Uh, you guys are entitled to yours. You guys could have thought that this movie was the greatest movie ever made or the worst movie ever made. The best part about this is this is it's everybody's opinion. I will never bash anybody for their opinion. I don't expect anybody to bash me for mine. If you want to have constructive criticism and talk and be adults about this, yeah, let's talk it out. Um, I am always down for a chit chat. If you want to sit here and tell me how this movie, the ending on this movie was perfect. By all means, explain it to me, because obviously I'm missing something because I didn't like it. It fell flat for me. If this is the worst movie ever made, please explain it to me, because apparently I don't know anything. So, like I said, I'm not trying to be a smartass or anything. I'm just saying I'm always down for... Sorry, I always play with my necklace. But I'm always down for chit-chat. So if you guys want to talk about this movie, that's great. But I do not want to see comments saying that I'm effing retarded because I didn't like The Witch or, you know, anything like that. So let's keep our own, everything clean. Um, again, you know, everybody's entitled to their own opinion. So please, and this goes for even the people that comment on my post. I don't want somebody else flaming them because of their um, ideas. So please, uh, let's just keep the trolling down. Um, just keep it all civil, but again, I do plan on doing lots of these because I do love watching movies, so I've always wanted to do these. I don't know why I never did, but yeah, um, and I promise they won't all be this long. Actually, some of them might be longer because there's some movies I really get into, but again, The Witch um, came out in 2015, and it's approximately 92 minutes, and it's great for 85 of them so um, yeah that's about it guys so let me know what you guys thought about this movie if you've seen it if not I hope you did not stay through the spoilers um, you guys were given a warning so don't blame me but that's it that's a uh, movie reviews with the tech and until next time y'all stay geeky